So how does private banking differ from wealth management? The two are very, very similar, but they're also very different. Private banking, you are managing capital for high net worth individuals and you're investing it in the financial markets. Simple. In terms of wealth management, you are taking more of a holistic approach when you're doing wealth management. You are not just taking high net worth individual money and investing it into the markets. When you're doing wealth management, you're doing that, but you're also looking at this high net worth individual's tax position. How can you make them the most tax efficient with their capital and their earnings and their wealth as possible? You're looking at their real estate portfolio. How can you be as efficient as possible when they want to buy real estate or sell real estate? You're looking at their potential will. Uh, how much money are they leaving behind? You're looking at how they are doing philanthropy, if that's something they're interested in. You're looking at managing how they are spending their money in order to meet certain goals. So let's say you have a client come to you and you're a wealth manager. You kind of talk to them and find out their profile. How much money have they got? How much wealth have they got? What do they want to do with it? Do they have children that they want to put to you know XYZ private schools? How are they going to fund that? What's the most efficient way to fund that? What's the best way for them to run their business in a tax efficient way? What's the best way for them to make donations or commitments in the most efficient way from a tax perspective and also from a business perspective or whatever other perspective that is important to them? So wealth management takes a holistic approach and it focuses on helping wealthy individuals throughout different areas of their lives, whereas private banking is just focused on investing their money and that's that. In wealth management, the client might come to you and tell you about their different lifestyle goals and choices and what they want to do and it's your mission to kind of help them get there in the most efficient way from various perspectives whether it's a tax perspective whether it's a financial perspective whether it's a real estate perspective inheritance whatever it might be as a wealth manager you're thinking about this individual's entire life whereas as a private banker you're just thinking about investing their money to get them a return that is in line with the risk appetite that they have so in summary private banking focuses on financial investing for high net worth individuals and wealth planning focuses on financial planning but also focuses on real estate planning, philanthropic planning, uh, tax planning, so on and so forth. If you learn anything new in the video let me know in the comments below. Let me know what video you want to see next and if you check out some of these videos they might be useful to you. Anywho I will see you in the next video. If you made it to the end you're a boss. Peace!